The tree is decorated. And there she is in all of her glory with all of her astounding, ridiculous ornaments upon her. Holy shitballs. It's so much. She is so much. And I am so tired. I'm in my robe because it's chilly in here. Whenever I have the tree up, I try to like not put the heat on in the living room so that she doesn't die. I'm wearing my Escape to Margaritaville bathrobe. That was my happy place earlier this year. I miss it still. My Camelot. My one brief shining moment. Anyway, this tree... It, it this year I, I just feel like the branches were ornament resistant they didn't want to no no i will not hold the weight of a simple glass thing <sighs> so it just it, it sections of it are just completely ungapachka if you don't know that if you don't know what that means ungapachka it's it's basically a yiddishism for one thing too many and this tree is at least one thing too many so let's wrap this up and talk about the christmas songs that i despise First of all, while we're talking Yiddishisms, why is there one Hanukkah song, the dreidel song? That's all any of us know, right? Am I right? Is there anything else that I'm missing? Oh, dreidel, dreidel, dreidel. Eh. Christmas songs that never should have been written, the novelty ones. Okay, let's start with the ridiculous, that little, weird little girl. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Elbows up, elbows up. What the hell is that song? It's not cute. She doesn't sound cute. She sounds like a demon. It's not the best. Let's talk about the one I really, if I never hear it again, Dominic the donkey. What is that? Why did that happen? So Italians have a Christmas song, Dominic the donkey. No, not necessary. Weirder than all of those. Remember that 60s song, Snoopy and the Red Baron, that song, that novelty song? So then they had to do a Christmas version of Snoopy and the Red Baron song. Why? I beg of you, why? None of these songs should exist, but they exist. So there. And that puts that to bed for you. Now let's talk one more Christmas song, okay? The Little Drummer Boy. Now the original version, it's weird. I am poor and don't have a gift for an infant. I'll go wake him up by playing a drum. I'm sure his mother was thrilled. Why are you playing that drum near my baby? I just finally got him to sleep. Thanks. In weird falsetto nun voices. Ba -ba -bum -ba. Why anybody on earth felt the need to do a cover of that song is beyond me. Has anyone heard a cover of that song that is worth hearing a second time? No, not even Joan Jett, who I adore. Not worth it. Anybody trying to do a rock and roll, rup a pum pum the words rup a pum pum don't need to be rock and rolled. Just as much as the words rup a pum pum don't need to be riffed. Rup a pum pum No one needs to riff on the word pum. No one needs to riff in general, but that's another story and I'm trying to get to bed. So really, Little Drummer Boy, no, no one needs to pum pum that song ever again for me. So anyways, I'm going to try to enjoy the tree. I'm going to try to see how long it is before the ornaments start giving up like, no, and falling to the floor. Already one down. This is when I came home tonight. One down. And, uh, and to all, a good night.